guys. So, you know, I was sitting here wondering about that explosion that happened in Lebanon. Still hasn't been any real answers. And there were some other explosions that didn't um, make the news. I think there was four of them all kind of around the same time. But then I started thinking about the brides. Do y'all remember the brides that were having photo shoots and weddings that day? Do y'all know that was a Tuesday? It was a Tuesday. Who gets married on a Tuesday? It's kind of bizarre. Let's look at the videos and then we're going to talk about some coincidences. First, there was the Bride of Beirut. Now, there is another Beirut bride who will never forget her wedding day. It started as a day filled with joy. The parents of the bride-to-be walking down the aisle. Suddenly, a loud noise. Then, all hell breaks loose. Another camera captures a guest making the sign of the cross as she enters the church. Then comes the blast. There's the bride, her special day, scarred by the tragedy. Outside, there is total chaos. Then they see the pall of smoke in the distance. And look, debris covers the interior of the church where the bride and groom and their guests would have stood. Fury is growing over the fact that government officials knew that nearly 3,000 tons of ammonium nitrate had been stored at the port for six years and did nothing. I spoke to American survivor Rebecca Hovland. She's from Minnesota and told me how she narrowly escaped death. I luckily went in the middle of my apartment and didn't stay by a window because that's when the second explosion came. And that was the much bigger blast that just shattered all of my windows instantly. Um, and I mean, I, I was quite convinced I was gonna.
You see how there, there's nobody even at the wedding. Why is there nobody at the wedding? It's free. Fancy wedding party. It's not like it, it obviously wasn't just like thrown together. There's nobody there. And what, what did that priest say before the explosion? Let's listen to it again. to hear him but he says Mary Magdalene right before the explosion it's kind of interesting then you look at the there's a Mary Magdalene church cathedral there and the time on it is 6 11 kind of like 9 11 weird I'm sure it's all just a coincidence. All these brides. I think it's a warning to some bride. To a bride of what kind of bride. I don't know. Y'all have a wonderful day. Like, share, and subscribe.